Hey guys, it's Madam Wario. Welcome back to more Let's Play Sims Busted. Now, it is a new week, and so it's time to go over goals before we officially get started because I took care of some business. We have been working on our popularity. Uh, it's kind of going well. I'm gonna, uh, yeah, I'll talk about that in a second. But, um, we still need to pester the lifeguard and find the cliffs, which will be done later, which is actually another employment goal and I totally forgot about it until I logged onto my old file on this game so I was like oh my god so yeah there are two more jobs left I'm just an idiot so you know anyway again um, we have to persuade Ophel McLean to drop out so we're still working on the negative relationships um, and oh my gosh I tried to make my relationship good with daddy big bucks and ultimately failed and now I have a negative 24 with him so awesome I did an awesome job you guys yeah it was super lame but whatever um, we'll work on it because that's about all we can do I just did not mean to fail that badly at that and then um, we talked to Vera finally. I didn't get it on camera because it was just way too hard to find her. So I figured I would just explain that goal number five on sheet five is from Vera. That's who you need to talk to if you're at this state in the game. And it requires convincing Detective Dan to set up Sting. Okay, whatever. You have to have relationship 60, which we have relationship 100, but we have to talk to him first in order for that goal to get reached. We have to acquire a camera and get a picture of a crime with Giuseppe. This is the point in the game where Giuseppe goes to jail, as I said. So if you have not purchased everything you want from him, then you need to do so, like, now. Because you're running out of time when this goal shows up. So, anyway, Detective Dan is right here. He's still in love with us, and we're going to tell him that Giuseppe is up to no good. He's up to theft! I knew it! Ah, but this is a very serious accusation, Coolio. I can't arrest him without solid proof. If you can catch him doing an evil deed, then we can knob him. If you get a photograph, I'll take it from there. Awesome mustache, man. Okay, he's weird. Oh, no. Okay, so yeah, you just need to talk to him first, because Detective Dan is really easy to become friends with. Uh, my popularity is at 34 right now. We need 16 more points in order to reach that first popularity goal. Man, I used to be like legit with Nicky Knack and you know, but I'm not anymore. I just need to work on these relationships and someone in the comments pointed out a really, really good... Yeah, they made a really good point. Um, I probably should have been working on my popularity before I started working on the negative relationships. Not that it's affected anything that badly, but it definitely makes the process take longer, and I did not even think of that until um, I read that comment. So thank you so much for pointing that out, because man, I was just like spacing that factor. But now I feel like I'm so close to negative relationships, I'll probably just complete it because then it's going to take me another like four sims days to get to the point I'm at right now again so that way we can just let them cool off and maybe use them for popularity if that makes any sense I know I sound like I'm rambling here but I just want to pass on as much information at this state in the game as I can or this stage in the game no pun intended um, or maybe I did intend for a pun Wow! Did I really just make almost $700 with this? Or almost $650, I should say. Okay, never mind. $670. I'm sorry! I didn't realize you were tired. I hate how I complain all the time. Oh well. Um, okay. So, anyway, that is the scoop on what is happening in this game right now. So, we need to get a camera. I am trying to get you home, chick. Shut your mouth. Okay. Let's see. Let's just go home. I'm pretty sure that... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that if you've been friends with somebody once in the game, it's naturally easier to re-become friends with them. Such as Nicky Knack, what I was pointing out. 
Um, you know, I don't know that for a fact. I don't know that that's a true game mechanic that's set up that way, but um, I do know that that is useful at least at this stage because it's just really weird to keep relationships with some of the other townspeople. Um, I don't know, but anyway, to talk about something else while we... Well, what do we need to do first? First, we need to find the camera. I don't remember where you get the camera, though. That is probably not good. Unless I have to ask somebody for it. Let's see. Of course, my uncle leaves the house when I try to talk to him. He does keep a lot of stuff in this backyard, though, so... Okay, but it's not in the backyard. Just kidding. Are you out here, doof? I need to talk to you. Oh, yeah, we paid, um... What's her face? Ten thousand dollars too. So that's officially done. I don't owe anybody money. Um. Wait, how did you get all the way down here? You can't farm with just eight chickens. Um. Excuse my sudden movements. I'm sorry. I'm trying to compliment you. But anyway, yeah, I do have a subject I want to talk about after this. Um. I'm sorry. You didn't give me one of those stupid chickens, did you? I'm sorry! Okay. I'll not a hug. Yay. Okay. Alright, so it's officially Tuesday, March... Uh, what is it? Tuesday, March 13th when this is going up? Uh, yes, that's correct. Meaning that Mario Party 9 just came out. Yes! I have officially played it. Okay, I've only played it once. I've played one board with Slim Kirby, the um, Toad's board. So, the very first board in the game. We thought it was appropriate. And I love it. I am not just saying that either. I seriously love the game. It's awesome. Like, the design is fantastic. The music, the whole like feel of the game, it is extremely well designed. I could not be more satisfied, seriously. Sure, the mechanic is totally different um, than before, but that does not make the game suffer at all. It is awesome, no joke. So, um, to anybody who's been wondering, because I know I'm going to get a million questions saying, what do you think of it? If you're watching this, I thought it was amazing. I loved it, literally. Um, it's a great game. Oh, and I love the music so much more than the music in Mario Party 8. The music in Mario Party 8 sounded like a drugged up version of a Sonic game, and I just really, that was one of the downfalls to it, and unfortunately, something that always makes a big impact for me in games is the music, so it was kind of like, oh, okay, well, that's fun, but, um, yeah, the music is excellent. I love it. It's such a fierce game. Like, not even kidding. So, if you're contemplating getting it and you are like, maybe you're not a complete Mario Party fanatic like I am, but you are a fan and you thought, oh, well, it looks so different from the other Mario Party games. I don't know if I want to get it or not. Seriously, get it. It is awesome from what I've seen of it. The mini games are so fun, too. Um, like... I haven't played all that many of them, but from what I have played, oh, they're so fun. It's just great, the way it's designed. Hey, I know you. Um, pfft, pfft, I'm not impressed. I love that. Only the strong survive! Um, but, what? I hear that Maximilian Four pays people to be his parents. Oh, I thought it said he pays people to be his parents. I was like, that doesn't make any sense. Seriously. Okay. Um, you know your gym is where the magic happened. Oh my god, I'm getting sidetracked again. But anyway, if you've been to my, um, website, which I sure hope you have, because I'm really trying to get my website more known on my channel to the general audience, but, um, anyway, if you've been there, you've seen that there is a link to a Mario Party page. But it has nothing on it yet, it's just coming soon. That's why I was waiting for Mario Party um, 9 to come out so I could make a review of every single Mario Party game thus far. Um, 
And same thing for Animal Crossing. Until Animal Crossing 3DS comes out, I probably won't finish that page. Um, or really do much with it. But, ooh, he's in love with us. Is there anything to do? Um, no. Okay. Anyway. I'm glad that he likes us when we say that. Um, you'd only look normal if you stood behind an elephant. Is that like a racist diss? Like, <laughs> that's, that's weird. Okay. Yeah, you guys know what I'm thinking. That sounded very racist if you know what I'm literally thinking. I'm sorry. Um, so anyway, yeah, I want to make that page all about every single Mario Party game thus far. So all 11 of them now. Um, because I am including the handhelds when I say that. Um, oh, he is man enough for a big hug. Oh, oops, we have to pee. I didn't know this. Um, so yeah, I just, I really wanted to say something about that first chance I got, and this video is literally the first chance I've gotten, so, um, yeah, I, I really love the game. I can't wait to play it, because I'll probably play it after this recording session for this game, so, um, anyway, yeah. In other news, I've been trying to brainstorm my next project, and I really want to do a Mario game next. Because I've been a super, I've been in a super Mario mood, but like every game I can think of to play is not a Mario game. Like, it's a Nintendo game, obviously, but it's not like Mario themed. So I'm like, oh, I'm kind of in the mood for Mario. But either the games that uh, all the games I've thought of are either like, I don't know, they're either something I'm not. I haven't played in a really long time, so I feel like my information's not going to be as accurate, like I would need to play it again now, um, before I actually Let's Played it. Um, but if not, it's a game I, I didn't own, but I've always wanted to play, and I'm kind of nervous to make a um, blind Let's Play just at this point in time. Just because it's approaching, like, second half of the last semester of the school year, and I know that that gets really stressful really fast in a lot of cases. Um, especially with how just wonky my schedule has been with uh, projects. So, I really am trying not to do anything heavy like that that's going to be like, oh, I don't know what I'm doing. But I should, because I feel like that's just going to be a, you know, something for disaster. Formula for disaster. Is there a camera in here? Of course not. I don't remember where we get the stupid camera. Unless we have to ask somebody for it. I don't know. I don't know, pimps. Maybe we have to buy it from Giuseppe himself. Who knows? Um, I don't know. Figure it out. But yeah, so I'm having a kind of a difficult time figuring out what I want to do next because of the whole Mario situation. I guess I could just drop the Mario idea and say, whatever, I'll just do a different game on my list. But, ah, oh, I've just been in such a Mario mood. So, I don't know. If you guys have any ideas, um, I know you probably don't know all the games that I haven't played, but unfortunately... Anything GameCube related that's Mario, I probably haven't played because I have said, you know, many times I didn't grow up with a GameCube. Um, that was the one Nintendo system I never had, so the first time I got to play GameCube games was like, right, it was like the winter before the Wii came out. So, I mean, I had a GameCube for a little while, but it wasn't technically mine, it was my sister's. And um, she didn't really have that many games for it. So really like the only Mario game I've, I know really well for GameCube is Double Dash and that's already on my list, but that's such like a small game, I don't know if I want to do that next, so you know, my mind goes in circles, so I'm, I don't know. If you guys have any suggestions, all I'm saying is you might want to stay away from, um, yeah, you might want to stay away from GameCube, just FYI. So, let's see, I enjoy learning new things, no matter how long it takes. Yay, she's our friend again. She doesn't like being tickled, though. I'm not the person I once was. Um, okay. So 
So, I'm running out of time. I'm actually out of time right now. Just looking at the clock. So, anyway, um, yeah, if you guys have any suggestions with that, that's how I'm gonna end this video. Feel free to share. Again, GameCube games, probably haven't played them, so try and stay away from those. Um, but other than that, feel free to make suggestions. So, yeah. I will see you guys next time, Spimps. Thanks for tuning in. Peace out.